Come here. Let me out. No, 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 no. What are you doing? What are you doing? This is T-Rex. What are you doing, land? Yep, now you that's great. Let's go. Let's get out of here. It's dangerous, man. And he's like playing with his toenails or whatever. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. All right. So, what is uh, It is your friendly neighborhood slip gator here, hanging out today, doing stuff and things. Playing some Mark Survival Evolved on the Pooping Evolved Ragnarok server. Hope you guys are having a good day. I'm having a great day. Thanks so much for coming to hang out with me today, guys. Make sure if you like the video that you see, ooh, a box with maybe a pike in it. Please don't forget, show your support and smash the thumbs up button. If you're new and you haven't already, primitive metal hatchet and a sword. Don't forget to subscribe as well. We'll keep those. We'll keep those. So yeah, guys, last episode, we did a bunch of stuff and things. We got our greenhouse rocking in and a rolling. All sorts of hot greenhouse action was had. We worked on getting some sap on the road to sweet veggie cakes so that we can tame a sheep. It's been like, this is a 12-part series on how to tame a sheep. It's going so well. Also, uh, in the infinite wisdom of the, the Ragnarok arc, uh, Ragnarok map dev, I hear that this person did not put the beehives in the redwood biome. They decided they would be different. They decided they would be original. Confusing. Original and change it and put them, some people are saying over here by the rocks at Blue Tower, which seems like an okay spot. It just doesn't make a ton of sense because normally they all spawn in the redwoods. So I decided to have a fly over here and take a look at some stuff and things. So yeah. We're doing stuff. I'm not seeing any straight away. Somebody said the rocks by Blue Tower. Let's head down over here maybe a little bit and take a look and see what's going on. I'm just not seeing any. And I was reading through the comments. I saw a couple people say this. And so I'm 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 hoping that it's true and not another lie. Like the cave behind the waterfall behind the base. It just was a big fat lie. But it's alright. So yeah. We're doing stuff and things. Uh, I expected to find a beehive here already. I expected there to be them everywhere. And I can't believe that we're not seeing any. I don't see them. Maybe like right down here by Blue Tower? Did you mean like at the Blue Tower? And I did a little bit of searching online too for people posting about bee locations on the Ragnarok map and I didn't find anything. I didn't find anybody posting. There's lots of Jetsum though. Whoa, what are you doing? Do you see that? Do you see him bounce? That was super weird. Let's go and check out the Flotsam and Jetsam and see if there's any stuff and things in here worth keeping. Primitive bow. This is super cool for early game. Like, for early game, I think this is very, very exciting. It's too bad that it didn't, like, have... Rarely have something a little bit better than kind of, like, super, super starter gear. But I think it is cool for the people who are just starting out on the map. Then, like, you can just come here and harvest some stuff and things, and then you'll get all the stuff. I'm thinking, I mean, we can keep those for eventually uh, when we get a grinder. As long as we don't have too much weight, eventually when we get a grinder. I also think I'm going to have to stop by the start of the community area to get some food. I just realized I don't have any. But for now, I guess, I'm just going to have a fly around here and check out some stuff and things and try to see if we can find these beehives. Um, I'm assuming they would be maybe up by these rocks. But I'm not exactly sure. Oh, also, I wanted to address a comment. I keep seeing that people are saying that I don't know about the... Uh, and I talked about it the other day, that I don't know about the how the griffin works for flying. Um, I don't really see much point in flying up and taking the time to fly up to then fly down to get a speed boost to go forward when you could have just flown forward. I guess maybe it does work pretty good. I think I find it just more a little bit tedious that you have to fly forward uh, uh, up in order to get that speed boost. But um, I'm completely aware of how the Griffer works. Uh, definitely understand uh, that it has that that flight mechanic. Um, so yeah, I was just trying to fly around here. I so believed you guys. I so believed the comments. I might be looking in the wrong spot though. But um, I thought we would just see them everywhere. I'm really confused as to where the beehives are on this damn map. I think today we're definitely going to find them. We're going to try to figure out a way to find them. Let's fly down, maybe down further is where they're at. On Crystal Isles, I thought it was so cool. The Crystal Isles map dev 
um, put like very special B areas that were um, kind of easily easy to find. Um, and when you got inside of there, there were a whole like underground B colonies. It was so cool. This is cool. Oh, what was that guy? A little hot carno action. Ooh, there's a T-Rex in here. Wow, that is kind of a neat little area in a sweet spot for bees if we had seen any. So I might be again in the wrong spot. I'm going to continue to look around. We will find beehives today if they're on the map. We're going to find them today. Uh, yeah, more exploring and I will be our bees, peeps. <laughs> and we're back. So, uh, yeah, I was reading through the comments again. It said the rocks near Blue Tower by the swamp. So I've got to find the swamp, but this map never ceases to amaze me. There's a huge buckleweka here. I don't even know what this is, but I want to fly through it because it's amazing and awesome. You know what? You could use this. You could mark it, and you could use the shadows to tell you what time of day it is. This is like a super cool clock deal thing. I think that's such a neat idea. You could take a look at this and say, like, right at, um, like, 1700, you could put a sign right in the middle of that circle, and you would be able to tell, like, a sundial what time it was. So I don't see any bees over here, but I just wanted to check this thing out. It's so cool. Such a neat thing. Um, be tough to build a base over here, though, but it would be a super, super cool spot. So, the rocks near Blue Tower by the swamp. And we're back. Oh, my God. I think I found a beehive. Oh, my God, a beehive! Oh, no, true dawn. Come here, come here, come here. I can't, I can't. Oh, it's a micro raptor. Okay. Whoa! His buddies are here! Whoa! No, no, no! Come here! Come here, come here, come here, come here! Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? You shouldn't be unaggressive! You shouldn't be unaggressive! Come here! Let me help! Ugh. No, 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 no! What are you doing? What are you doing? There's a T Rex! What are you doing, land? Yep, now you. That's great! Let's go! Let's get out of here! It's dangerous, man! And he's like playing with his toenails or whatever. <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. All right, so uh, let's go ahead and drop some of this stuff out of here. Uh, we got a T-Rex over here. I didn't get a chance to take a look at what kind of uh, level we got going on, uh, just so that we know. It's a 20. Okay, it's just a 20. Hold on, hold on. Let's try this. I wonder if we can kill a level 20 T-Rex with our little drop thing. Oh, what? We accidentally we killed a 135 Raptor? Oh, my God. These things are amazing. Okay. So, we don't have the bug repellent. Oh, crap. Did I bring my ghillie suit with me? Okay, we have our ghillie suit. Let's go you, bam. No, 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 no. Something's here. You want to go? Is that what you want to do? Yeah, I didn't think that's what you wanted to do. Ghillie suit. Now, we didn't make the... We didn't make the bug repellent. So, I'm not really sure how this is going to work. There's a lot of these guys over here, man. I don't want to get dismounted while I'm doing stuff. Where you at? Okay, we got that guy. Okay, so the plan is... This is the plan. We use our bullets, okay? We use these bullets to shoot the beehive. Then, the mama bee comes out, and we will feed it a rare flower. And this will completely work. It'll be unbelievable and amazing, and it will make all of the searching for the beehives worth it. Oh, I think I see a bee up there. Hold on a second here. Is that just like wild giant bee level five? So that's not the queen though, right? We've got to break the hive to get the queen. Oh, okay. Okay, there's a lot of bees. Oh, oh my God. Oh my God. Oh, ow, ow, ow. The OG, the OG. Okay, we'll, we'll be using this from now on. Holy crap, did that hurt? Ow! Oh my god. You know, before we break this hive completely, I feel like I might need to go get some meat. <laughs> and we're back. All right, meat has been gotten. Stuff and things are going. That's the beehive right there. I just noticed there's another one over to the right side there too. Or the, yeah, right there. So I don't know if this guy regains HPs or not. But what we're gonna do now, instead of uh, instead of trying to uh, pike them, we're just gonna go ahead and get on the OG. 
and attack them with the OG. So that didn't do it yet. Okay, they're there. Whole batch of them. Oh my god, come here, man. Come here, homie. Oh, that worked way better. Yeah. Super smart. Okay, we're good. We're doing good. Everything's going great so far. All right, another swarm. How many bullets? Whoa, oh my god, I just shot the LG. Oh no. Ugh. Whoa, is that the queen? Oh, crap, 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 crap. Is that it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I can't move. What just happened? Did it die? Oh my god. <laughs> I think that was the queen. But I don't see... Did the bee... Oh, the beehive didn't break. Okay, the beehive didn't break. It must have just been a bee really up close. Then the OG. How much did I annihilate you for? Oh, no big deal. You're good. I don't think that was the queen. Because the queen, I don't think, appears until the hive breaks, right? Okay, let's get over here. Oh, my God. This is such a process. Okay, we're doing good. How long does this go on for? How many waves? <laughs> this is taking forever! Hey, we're back. All right, so what I'm discovering is that the hive seems to heal super, super fast. And it looks like, I don't know. Okay, so the hive's up to 5,000. Let's go ahead here, let's reload. Let's fire. Reload. Click this. Check the hive. So we did a hundred, only a hundred damage to it. That's, oh my God. And every time we get hit from the bees, we get dismounted. So, um, yeah, we're going to have to do damage to this way, way more quickly. What if we come up here like this and, oh, that's it. That just did some stuff. I mean, should we just like, Oh, I'm attacking it. I'm trying to not hit too much so that when it finally breaks. Oh, there it is. Crap. I killed it. No. Okay. Did it, does it have a body? Oh, is this, a, is this a little bag? Is this this little bag right here? Oh, that's the beehive. Oh, I'm hitting E to access it. <gasps> oh my God, the honey! Honey for days! Okay, gather rates are still aft on the server. Uh, That looks like a good amount. How much weight is that? Oh my God, it doesn't weigh anything at all. Okay, so, oh, here's the queen right here. Giant queen dead. Okay, D-E-D -E dead. Okay. So we, we have an idea and then the, the hive didn't actually break. Like physically, it's still, he oh look, it's still, have it's still regenerating hit points. That is so weird. I thought it would like break, break. So now we know we have to be super careful when we're attacking because that the, the hive itself isn't gonna shatter. You know what I mean? It's just going to eventually burp out a queen. Hey, we're back at base. And I figured if we're gonna do this, let's do it the right way. Cause I think that Without the bug repellent, we might end up having a bit of a problem. So we have our amazing greenhouse now with all of our amazing greenhouse stuff and things. We need some citronel. We need some, you know what? We might as well grab all of this stuff because then we can put it into our preserve, preserving bin. Let's grab this. Citronel and rock hair are what we're gonna need in order to craft stuff and things up here. We've got a ton of uh, fertilizer in here. I went ahead and crafted up along the way as we were doing some other stuff and things. Squirt this inside of here like so. These are stem berries for poop. We'll leave those inside of there. All right, so we got all this stuff. We're gonna be able to craft up a bunch of narcotics with our uh, narco berries, and we've got a good amount of stuff and things so we can make up some of the bug repellent as well. So we'll head right over to this guy. We'll go ahead and squirt citronel and rock carrot inside of there. Head over to our preserving bin where I've already squirted our honey in. You know what? There's so much of this. this is, we're just gonna drop some of it uh, like so. We'll go ahead and put the rest of all of our veggie tubbles inside of here, and then in our last deal over here we'll go ahead and squirt all of our narco berries and then i think we should have a bunch of spoil do we have spoiled meat wait what where's my spoiled meat did my spoiled meat all spoil that's probably what happened 
Does anybody have spoiled meat? Close your eyes. Sorry about that. Uh, yeah. Okay, so we don't have any spoiled meat. All right. We're going to have to get some. We'll get some meat, and we'll stick it in our little spoiling meat, and we'll do that. Uh, so we're also going to need what else? Pelt we have right here. Like so. We'll grab all this. Narcotics as well. We're just going to craft up a bunch. I mean, yeah, I guess. Let's go ahead, squirt, squirt, squirt. Is that all the things? Durugas? How many can we craft? 25? Feels like a lot. How about five? So we'll craft up five bug repellent, and that should be everything that we need. We've got our hot ghillie suit action. Whoa. Inappropriate. We've got our bug repellent. We know how to get the giant bees to come out. Now we just need to make them come out. And tame them. And we're back over at our beehive. Okay, moment of truth. Kind of, kind of get lined up. Uh, inventory. Use this guy. No, 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 no. Like so. And two. Okay, we're good. Ten minutes of bee juice. We gotta get like lined up just right. Are we hitting it? Oh, it dismounted me. Crap. That's weird. Didn't happen last time. It did it again! Okay, this didn't happen last time at all. I know every time the bees attack you, they, they dismount you. Okay. Oh, what's going on over here? Okay, we need to get this out of here. We got a hot Sarko up in our business. You want to go? Oh, I think it's high level. 135. Oh, baby. And some hot bee action. Did we harvest a bunch of crap? Okay, let's go ahead and take the meat. Like so. Drop. Yes. Bam. The other day escape stops. Okay, we've got to be really careful here. I'm trying to get... There we go. Keep your eyes peeled. What? No, giant bee! This is such a jip! Okay, no bee that time. We've got another hive over here. I'm hoping we can make this happen. Let's try this guy out. Are we hitting it? No bees are coming out. So this this worked last time. Oh, there's a there's a bag right there. So this is weird. No bees are coming out of here. I wonder if it's already been harvested. No bee. Okay, well, we found a couple of hives. We found one giant bee, but that's it. None of the other giant bees are working. None of the other hives had giant bees. What are you? That's the beehive inventory. I can't, uh, I can't with you moving around like that, homie. Come on, let's come up a little bit closer like so. Okay, it's got uh, huge, ridiculous amounts of honey. We'll just take a little bit. Like so. I really want to tame one of these bees, man. Why is this such a thing? I don't know. Oh, is that one? Oh, is that one of the bees? Oh, I got my rare flowers. I got my bug repellent. Are you one of the bees? Are you one of the bees? What is I think? Wow, bee queen. We did it! We tamed it! Oh my god, we got it! Can we can we pick it up, please? Oh, it's got little buddy bees with it. Can we Obtain beehive, options, harvest settings, behavior, options, change name, unclaim, back, behavior, stance, no, uh, passive, okay, I named it, ooh, alright, this doesn't look like there's a way to pick it up, so I think we're gonna have to have it follow us all the way back to base, that's quite a ways, and it doesn't move very fast. It tamed out at level seven. All right, that's awesome. Okay, we got it. We tamed a bee. I can't even believe it. It was like a, it was a roller coaster of emotions. It was like it worked, and then it didn't work, and then it worked. 
Oh, this is gonna take a long time. If this thing dies, how are we gonna get it back to base? Look how slow it is! Oh no! This is a terrible disaster! And we're back. Coming in for a landing. <laughs> oh my god, guys. What excitement! That was the most exciting! It wasn't exciting. It was super snorry. We had to bring this guy all the way back. It was, it took such a long time. It took such a long time. It moves so slow. I don't, I'm, I don't think you can pick it up. Oh, we got it. We got it. Here it is. Oh, don't hit him. So we never even really obtained beehive. Okay. We don't want to do that. We don't want to do that. Can we check? Is this the bee? Ooh, the queen bee. 80 hit points. 200 stamina, 150 oxygen, 800 food. That's odd. 150 weight. You can like put seven things on it. Oh yeah, you got room for stuff and things. Oh, is this already? This honey's already getting uh, gonna spoil. 500 torpidity, right? So I'm not really sure how this works for obtaining the hive. Let's go ahead over here. Will you like follow me into a house? You don't want to check this out. Let's set its view distance distance for low. Okay, come here. Come here. You won't. You won't come here, will you? So that's going to be super hard to like get it inside of something. I want to go ahead and squirt this honey in here and just take a look at how much the timer changes. So let's see here. This is one hour and then these guys are 12 hours. So they'll actually be gone by like tomorrow if we don't use them up or oh, full. Okay. Can we eat this? We ate giant bee honey. Did it just make a fart noise? Oh, no, no, no. That was the preserving bin. Where did the bee go? Okay. Come over here, homie. I want to try to get you into the taming pen, into the, pardon me, the greenhouse. But there's no way to pick it up. Obtain beehive, options, harvest settings, harvest settings. Yeah, 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 that's not what we want. Modify order groups. No, that's not what we want. Behavior, passive stance, change from target medium, change follow distance, ignore group whistles, enable wandering. That's not what we want. Yeah, there's no way. There's no way to like pick it up or anything like that. So, and then we can't, there we go. All right, so let me go ahead and see. I want to put him in here. I think this would be a good spot for the hive, but I don't know how we're going to be able to get him in. Uh, I guess we could just toggle the doorway. Yeah, stupid. We could just toggle the doorway to manual. That would probably be a good way to do it. Let's go ahead and switch this to manual, and then it will be open. Will you come in? Oh, it's in! It's in. Okay, come over here. Oh, I, I really wish I could get you to go exactly where I want. Can I? I can't push you. Can I, I mean, let me pick up this wall. Okay. I want it to be like right in the middle of this. Oh, oh, oh. 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 Pick this up. Oh, 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 don't move. Okay. This way, just a, just a smidge. No, no, oh, God. This way, just a smidge. This way, just, just a little over here. Okay, no. And then now just a little. No. Oh, God. It turns in like a circle. This way, just... Uh, it's that We're never doing it because it turns in a circle. Let's go this, like this. No, like this. Okay. Now, what if we bring you straight this way? Until you are... Good. Uh, I mean, I feel like this is as good as it's going to get. Let's just hit E. Wait, what? Oh, what? I thought you had to do it. I'm such an idiot. Oh, my God. We can just place it. Oh, so dumb. I thought I thought it, like, created it. I didn't think it made it into a placeable. I didn't know. I feel dumb. It's all right. We learned a lesson. We learned a valuable lesson. Um, I just assumed with everything else so far, this has been so hard. I just assumed it would be hard. <laughs> oh, is this... Oh, no, wait, we got to, there we go, like so, like so. All right, so we can't actually place the beehive in here because of uh, the ceiling here. So I think we're going to have to do a little bit of modifications. And we're back. Oh, so, so much learning is going on this. Uh, this. So uh, you can't place a beehive in on a floor. I didn't even read the little warning. I just assumed that it was clipping like this. I didn't even read up there. It says very plainly, can't place beehive, uh, can't place on floor, which I think kind of sucks. It would be cooler if you could have like a little area. I mean, you could still build a little area, but I kind of wanted a little beekeeper spot. 
I wanted it inside of there. I just had my heart set on that. So I'm thinking we might just put it out back here. But before we place it, we're going to go ahead and take some more bug repellent. Um, <sighs> these guys are powered. Let me see here. Let's place it. Okay, we did it. We did it. Poop Narok evolved. Beehive nailed it. Ace the camping stop. Uh, let's go ahead and invent to its inventory. It is powered by rare flowers. So we should be able to put these inside of there. I'm that's what the wiki says. I've never seen a video on this stuff, so I'm just kind of winging it. I like doing it this way, but it is always a learning experience. It makes you feel kind of silly sometimes. So it's supposed to craft uh, honey over time. I don't think we need to, like, activate it. All we can do is demolish it. We can't pick it up. We can access its inventories, but it will do stuff and things for us over time. Look at it! Look at it in all of its glory! Our amazing beehive! I can't even believe that we did it. We actually did it, guys. And now... We will be able to make sweet veggie cakes. With all that honey that we've got, we should be able to get some more honey. We have, I do believe, all the materials that we need. Um, the only thing about this that we're going to have to be careful of is that with this hive, I am reading uh, that if you approach it without um, without bug repellent or a ghillie suit, um, the bees will attack you. So, yeah. Yeah. It's a dangerous, dangerous game we play. But that's going to be it for today's peeps. Giant bee taming stuff and things. Thanks so much for coming to hang out with me. Make sure if you like the video, please don't forget. Show your support and smash the thumbs up button. Feel free to share and favorite the videos you see fit. And may the stuff and things be with you.